In this tutorial, we are going to go through subtraction of two digit numbers and ones using the vertical method. Let's start with a simple example. What is 47 minus 5? 47 minus 5. Now you can do this using the dot method and the head and fingers method, but we're going to do this using the vertical method so that you can get accustomed to doing this, which will help when you are subtracting larger numbers. So the vertical format, we write these numbers down in columns. So let's do that. 47 minus 5. Let's put an equal sign. 47 minus 5. We can label the columns. We don't have to, but we can. The column on the right hand side is units. The one next to it is tens. And when we are subtracting using the vertical format and when we are adding, we start with a column on the right hand side. So let's do this. Units, the column on the right hand side. What is 7 minus 5? 7 minus 5. That's right, it is 2. Now we do the tens. What is 4 minus 0? There's nothing there. 4 minus 0 is 4. And that is our answer. 47 minus 5 is 42. Nice and easy. Let's do one more. What is 76 minus 8? 76 minus 8. Let's write the numbers down in the vertical format. We write down 76 minus, we write down 8, we can label them if we want to, units and tens. So let's do this. What is, and we start with a column on the right hand side first, what is 6 minus 8? 6 minus 8. Well we can't do that because 6 is smaller than 8. 6 is smaller than 8. So what we have to do is we have to take 1 from the number next to it. What we do is we cross out the 7. We're going to take 1 from here. So 7 minus 1 is 6 and we put that 1 over here. Did you see how we did that? We took 1 from here so 7 minus 1 is 6, and that 1 we put over here. The units column has now become 16 minus 8. 16 minus 8. And the answer is, that's right, it is 8. Now we do the tens column. We are no longer looking at 7, because that has become 6. So this is now 6 minus 8. 0. There's nothing here. 6 minus 0 is 6. And we have our answer. 76 minus 8 is 68. Now did you understand how we did this? If not, what we're going to do is we're going to do this same question again. 76 minus 8. How did we do this? First, we wrote the numbers down in columns. 76 minus, we're going to do minus 8. Nice equal sign at the bottom. And now what we do is we subtract starting from the column on the right hand side. Here, the number 6 is smaller than number 8. So we can't subtract this. What we have to do is we have to take 1 from here. So 7, we cross that out. 7 minus 1 is 6. So the 7 has now changed to 6. 
and that one we have taken from here becomes the one over here. This number is now 16 because the number we have taken is a 10. It's become 16. So now the units column looks like this. It is 16 minus 8. The answer is 8. And in this case it is, in the tens column, it is 6. Not 7. The 7 has become 6. 6 minus 0 is 6. And that is our answer. 76 minus 8 equals 68. And that is subtraction of two-digit numbers and ones using the vertical format.